10 Ways an Affair Affects a Relationship An affair can ruin a relationship in the most devastating way. Infidelity is a betrayal that comes with many consequences. The grieving and recovery journey could be emotionally traumatizing. It might be challenging to move past it, and it could cause some permanent damages to all parties involved. Cheating partner, the partner cheated on, and other stakeholders like children and close family and friends. Here are 10 ways an affair affects a relationship. Number 10. Loss of trust and intimacy. The first thing that is attacked in a relationship when an affair is introduced is trust. Nobody can continue to trust a person after keeping another relationship active while being together. You will have to try for a long time if you can ever win back the trust you once shared. In addition, your intimacy could be affected by an affair. The tension in the house could take over your moments of intimacy and affection. Confirmed news of affairs made a sharp decline in trust and intimacy and every other activity the couple engaged in. That could introduce loneliness and sadness. If it stays on for a long time, then it can become the starting point of your drifting apart. Number 9. Career suffers from emotional pain. The careers of both parties may suffer immeasurably when an affair is in the picture. Before one is caught, they spend all their time covering up the affair. That could mean being disorganized and unfocused. The one being cheated on will then try to help solve their partner's distorted problem. When the emotional toll of an exposed affair occurs, both parties go through more rough patches. The blame game and trying to cover up also eats into work. It worsens if they are entrepreneurs and works longer hours to keep their businesses afloat. Only a heartless cheat will not feel the impact of their affair exposed as much as the one who had endured infidelity. Number 8. Countless Hours in Counseling The long hours spent in counseling could have been used to do so much more in their lives. Anyone who has been through therapy can tell you that there are days when you practically imagine all the places you could be while sitting opposite your therapist. Those hours could be productive for your career, children, family, or social life. Working things out with the help of a professional is necessary, but you have to do the math on the value of time. Not only yours, but the importance that a therapist or counselor attaches to each hour. Number 7. Cost of Healing Bringing the issue of counseling's value to full introspection. Therapy is expensive. That is why the court adds the burden of treatment as an additional cost for the victor. However, since you decided to work on your marriage yourself, it is your cost to bear. The money involved in getting counseling and trying out some of the exercises could damage your budget. The healing route is not cheap, and if you have children, you will only spend more. That is why you should be more cautious in your choices to avoid these unwanted costs on yourself and your partner. Number 6. Emotional Consequences of Guilt The guilt you face from being the cause of all these problems in your family is sometimes underestimated. You are indeed the reason for the whole situation, and you deserve to be blamed, but that does not mean your emotional trauma should be ignored. The dynamic import of understanding that the society, your family, and the person you cheated on could all be in their own place due to your terrible decisions could be damning. That is why it can be healthy to give your partner some time to cool off while you also hide away and indulge in positive activities to uplift your soul. There are no easy ways out of being the villain of the story. While there should be no sympathy for you, you need to keep your head above water and handle the issue to the best of your ability. Number 5. Damage to Self-Esteem one of the lasting effects of an affair is the lowering of self-esteem. A partner's decision to cheat despite being in a healthy and happy relationship would leave a permanent scar on the self-esteem of the partner who was cheated on. They might feel like the other person is better than them or no longer appealing. It can hurt their confidence and have them doubt their entire existence. It all starts with constantly asking what they did wrong to warrant the affair. While in some cases, all parties must share the blame, Infidelity rests on the partner who cheated. They are the ones who lack better judgment. They lie to everyone, and they are the ones who should be ashamed. It is not because you grew less attractive or became too old. There is no reason to feel less confident or feel your self-esteem lowered because your partner had an affair that has become public. You need to uplift yourself and keep reminding yourself that you are who you know you are. That is the only way to keep yourself from falling apart. Number 4. 
Sexual Health Risks The scary part about an affair is the risk of sexually transmitted infections. Even when protection is used, there are times when accidents occur. It becomes a burden on the partner who stays true to their commitment but has to deal with it. In cases where you do not know whether you have been infected or not, the scare can be painful. This is because people who cheat are sneaky with the details, and so you cannot confirm whether they are telling you everything you need to know to assist in health precautions. There could also be the part where they had other affairs you still do not know about and those who have implications you are not guarded against. You can ask for the truth and insist on knowing all histories and timelines of affairs for health reasons. You can also have regular checkups to ensure that you are free from the risk of any sexually transmitted diseases. Number 3. Shame to Children Children can be the most affected when details of affairs become public. They feel confused and in deep shock over the influx of information. While trying to process these things, they also have to live within a hostile environment of dead silence or anger and violent retaliation. They might face childhood depression or stress, which would impede their schoolwork and social life. Children may start talking more to the wrong people and getting into the wrong type of activities. These could be unmonitored because both parents are emotionally stressed and trying to deal with the problem at hand. It might be helpful to get the child a chance to speak to a professional early on to receive help. You can also keep them out of the house in the early stages of the confrontations. Number 2. Negative Emotions Towards Future Relationships When the relationship ends, the future could be ruined for you. Your expectations going into the relationship could lessen or get highly unattainable. It could also affect your trust issues when you meet someone who genuinely cares about you. You tend to be wary of people in project past situations on innocent individuals. This behavior could make it difficult to love, becoming the toxic one, all for being the victim of infidelity. It would help if you had time to get yourself back on track and understand that what one person did to you is not the burden of everyone who genuinely cares for you. It also gets intense when you meet people to prove more than they can that they are good. Immediate future relationships are often bound to fail for this reason. It is essential to do the work on yourself first. Number 1. Emotional Instability When you go through the painful experience of an affair, you can get emotionally unstable. The whirlwind of emotions keeps coming back and forth at random times. One day, you blame yourself for your partner's lack of happiness in the relationship. The next day, you could be upset and hold negative feelings towards your partner to the point of contemplating physical pain. Another time you could start seeing your lifestyle as a motivation for your partner's actions and start hating the things that make you happy. It is not healthy for your mental framework. Moreover, if you have underlying mental health crises or undetected mental health illnesses, this could be the breaking point. You might end up going too far in your thoughts and breakdown and experience either relapse or manic attack, which could produce further implications for the relationship and your lives forever. There could be some PTSD connected with memories of affairs. The triggers lead to depression, anxiety, and stress. The lasting impact on the couple and children makes relationships a touchy subject. Couples and families who have worked through it have done so with time and therapy. What other consequences of cheating in relationships do you know? Have you ever experienced infidelity or betrayed someone you were in a relationship with? What effect did it have on you? And how did you get out of it? Please share your thoughts with us.